so this is Cooking Simulator again. I played Cooking Simulator a while back. There was a pizza DLC. And I couldn't not stream pizza DLC for Cooking Simulator. So after losing the job at the game store, now we get to make it a pizza! The fuck is this chaos tool? I will just do the pizza. Fulfill your dream of running a real pizzeria. Prepare authentic dough and tasty sauces. Tasty sauces! Use professional machines for maximum efficiency. And assemble gorgeous looking pizzas to meet your customers' fancies. So I've made real pizza like three times in my life. It wasn't amazing, but I did it. It was okay. Let's see if I can also pizza in Cooking Simulator. Wow, the menu. <laughs> the menu. Welcome to Papa Pepe's Pizzeria. <laughs> Frank Pepe. Your training begins now. Let's cover the basics first. I'll show you how to assemble a pizza from already prepared ingredient. Bake it in the oven and finally serve. So we start with the dough. Neapolitan dough. We, we put it on the bake board. That's the bake board. Well, I don't even get to do any of that. What? Well, where's the game part of this? So here's the shelf. We can strafe. Use the mouse on the highlighted container. Oh, there it is. Sauce. Okay, first, uh, let me show you the... This is a technique for the marinara. Okay, a little bit of the technique. Wow, there's actually, like, sauce physics. Alright, that's a good marinat. We're gonna go a little bit more. We like a little bit more marinat on the pizza. Okay. Mozzarella. Add some cheese. Okay, that's enough, he says. Nope. Not enough. Nope. Look, I made a face. It's meat. <laughs> I just ruined a perfectly good pizza with too much sauce. Okay. Press Q or E to rotate the cheese. My pizza is made complete with the finest geographic, uh, geometric patterns. Otherwise, it's not good. A few basil leaves will do the trick. I mean, some of my favorite pizza in Brooklyn has just fucking full basil leaves on it. I'm not kidding. And it's good. Pick up a log. Well, what the fuck is wrong with this game's performance? What What's... Was there a dungeon down here? Like a pizza dungeon? Is Mario in here? Whoa, menu! <laughs> oh, 
Welcome to the menu! Pasta Fazul! Enjoy! The oven needs to reach optimal temperature. You can check the temperature on the thermometer. Oh, it has to be in the green area. Someone is stealing my pepperoni. Please no. I've had enough of video game thieves. Why do I hear Italian music? I'd like to think that there's just some, like, Italian man just blasting that in the hallway. Wonder if I can play my own pizza music while I'm doing this. Okay, now we pick up at a pizza peel. Is that what they're called? I thought they had like a, a fancy Italian name. Precise tool handling. Holding down shift will open up new ways to manipulate whatever you're currently holding. This thing's got physics. Okay, now we grab it a pizza, and we're gonna shove it, shove it a pizza in. Okay, here we go. Wait until the pizza finishes a baking. Okay. Do we need more wood? Not yet. Almost. Almost. Should hide the meat under the cheese and give the customers a pepperoni secret. Looks pretty good. Needs another three seconds. Three, two, one. Perfect. Just a little extra burnt. I like it when it's a little burnt. That's a one beautiful margarita. Place it on a plate and serve it through the serving window. There we go. All right, now we serve it through the serving window. <sighs> the Italians invented anti-gravity. This whole time. I guess there's no way to get the pizza back, huh? Go out there and get it. 
you think they would program an entire outdoor area for this game? Okay, here we go. We continue from here because the pizza, I think, still exists. Come on, pizza. Come on, a pizza. Well, oh, oh, here it is. Nice. Floor pizza. It's good. While holding the pizza peel, click on the plate. Oh, okay. No, the, the floor is clean. You know what I mean? Like, we use only... We don't wear shoes in this kitchen. Hang on a minute. Ah, uh, there's gotta be a way to order another... ...plate. Nope. Oh, they're right there. Wow. Serving plate may be a little too big. Orders up! Why did I get two stars on each side? <laughs> Okay, let's start with preparing some Neapolitan-style dough. So you gotta familiarize yourself with the recipe. Launch Pizza Pro app and find the recipe we need. Wait, what? The Pizza Pro app? Okay, so we need, um... We can pin the recipe. And then we go to Quest Villa? Oh my god, it's a battle pass. It's a pizza battle pass. Amazing. This is all Italians play. Just this. Prove yourself a diligent apprentice. And I will grant you the title of Novice Pizziolo. And let you run this pizzeria by yourself. Alright. Hey, Apprentici! What are you doing? Looing at the sky! It's the dough mixer. So we got to add the ingredients first. So we're going to um, get some flour. Try not to go bankrupt. What, did they watch me play the other game? There we go. Nice graphics. I 
I've never seen flower physics like that in my life. That's really good. Excellent graphics. I think we need to purchase the yeast. Wow, it's so small. But the yeast is in there. Are we just going to leave the bag of flour in there? I can't get it. I can't pick it up. Oh, okay. Now it's good. Let's be responsible Italians and, and we'll throw our yeast bag, sorry, flour bag onto the shelf over there. Okay, next is water. Mario, where are we going to get water from? Everywhere, Luigi. Everywhere. Okay. Can I use the sponge? All right, we've got enough water. Sponge? Okay. Oh, the moist sponge is what gives the pizza its, uh, you know, its, its wetness. It's good. Do I not have any fucking cups? Really? Oh, jug. Hopefully the tap water here is good. It's got to be good, right? I mean, it's Italy. My whole life I've been told Italy has the best of everything. I'm beginning to think... Strong jug. The Curlin Nescar has been broken. Here I am saying Italy has the best of everything, and their jugs can't survive two inches of pressure. Oh, God. Dear, oh dear. Dear, oh dear. Oh dear. Yeah, I need to buy more. Another jug. That's that's more money. That's more money that's going to be wasted. But don't worry, this business is definitely going to last. Okay, so I need... Uh I wasn't trying to break it for comedic effect. I 
I really was not trying to break it. I need more water. Come on. Just a little bit more. Yep. Oh, oh, oh. Oh, oh. That's, how do you set this thing down? God damn it. That's three jugs instantly broken. I need salt. Okay, so salt. That's easy. Isn't there, like, different technology to add larger quantities of salt? Oh. Uh-oh. No, it's good. Listen, a little extra water and a tiny little pinch more salt, that's my secret recipe. That's how I make the pizza my own. It's not too salty. It's going to be fine. For safety reasons, the dough mixer has to be closed before it can be turned on. Well, what if I want to reach in and make sure it's... You know, it's good. Do not press the red button. It will clear the bowl of its stored ingredients. Use it only if you made a mistake. Saving. Now chat, my secret ingredient in the dough is raisins. That's how you make a good pizza. There it is. There's the dough. So we begin with our marinara sauce. Okay. Here we go. Here we go. San Marzano tomato. Delicious. Clean up. There we go. Good cleaning physics. All right, we got to go get the tomato. <laughs> Sniffles again tonight. Slight allergies. I apologize for that. We need fresh vegetables. Okay. Pick up basket. Okay, we got the basket. Gather ingredients. So we're going to gather four cloves of garlic. I would go five if it was up to me. Get those tomatoes. So ripe. Delicious tomato. Now I sound like fucking Tony Montana from Scarface. Delicious little tomato. Place the basket's contents onto the cooking processor. Where's where's that? There's there's like too much stuff on the screen now.
That's the cooking process. Put everything in the cooking processor. Okay. Wow. Just hovers. I told you about them Italians and their anti-gravity tech. We need some olive oil, herbs. You will find herbs in the herbarium. I wonder if there's any herbariums in the chat tonight. Since we're preparing almost two liters of sauce, we'll add a whole sprig instead of a few leaves. You'll find the rest in the ingredients box, so we need basil, olive oil. Salt. Where's the herbarium? Oh, there it is. So we'll get that in there. Full. Full basil. We'll get some salt in there, too. Great. Okay. And we use olive oil. Pick this up. Spin! There's an incinerate button, but it doesn't work. Weird. Okay. Uh, olive oil. What are the Italians saying? They're saying uh, v Dub stream last night was, was bad. He's not good at video games. They, I think it was something like that. Yeah. Not too much. A little bit of olive oil, huh? Rub it on the feet. That way you can do... You can slide around in the kitchen. And you can make it good and nice. You can, you can cook fast that way. Huh? Get some dried oregano. For the real flavor. I see no ingredients in there. This game is a ripoff. Gordon Ramsay uses a shit ton of uh, olive oil. He does. All right, teaspoon, teaspoon of olive oil, and then he just fucking like two seconds later, three seconds later, he's like, "All right, perfect." Just dumps the whole thing into the pan. Take one of the empty GN canisters that you find and insert it into the cooking. Oh, I see. Now we can prepare the sauce. I don't think they use this in old Italy. There was definitely... I don't have any dropped frames. There was definitely like an old lady, like a babushka lady. That's probably the wrong culture, but, um, who was, they just, you know, put a little olive oil on her feet. Alright, now crush them tomato tomatoes, hey. I don't know what's happening. Oh, I've, my, my brain. I can unpin. Wait, unpin. Pick up the basket and go to the pantry. Nona, right? The, the Nonas. It was an old Nona. I can't pick up the thing, chat. I can't make the good pizza. 
Vinny, that's not a basket. I thought maybe that was the name for it. We get the rest of the ingredients. Was this the meats? Salami? Very nice. Very good salami. Where's the pepperoni? We carved that pepperoni directly from the pepper pig. That's what happens. You just carve it right off. And black olives. Does anyone see any black olives down here? The floor? Okay, here we go. Delicious. <laughs> what? Why are they scattered? Like this? What the fuck happened to them? We could just bring this whole can with us. That's fine. Whoa. Okay, we're gonna put down the basket. Oh, I put like a broken glass in there. Have you ever had broken glass pizza? Oh, you haven't lived until you tried the broken glass variety. I like how the game just put the basket down like that and I didn't. Take the GN container out. Oh, that's what that is. Okay. Put it on the handrail and see what happens. It sounds like a threat. That's like an Italian threat. Okay. Well, I did that. Oh, over here. Oh, God, I'm such a dumbass. Wow! This is smart. That is technology! Pick up the salami. 300 grams of salami. Okay, I got my salami. Put it in the automatic cutter. You know, again... I'm not positive that we had this technology in the 1900s. When pizza was first in I don't know when pizza was first invented. Invented it. I'm a fake Italian. That's a lot of slices of salami. Okay, we gotta pick up the mozzarella. There's a place I go to that they call it Mootsie. Electric grater. Mootsie, please! It's true. Because it's, you know, a lot of people pronounce it mozzarella. Mozzarella? I don't know why. And not mozzarella cheese. And so it gets turned into mutsi. It's the progression. It's how language evolves over the years, where you just say the thing that's easiest to say. I like how Sphinx is like actually dropping like facts about pizza making. 
and I'm busy, like, bastardizing the process. Someone said, honestly, why do you consider yourself to be a fake Italian? Well, who cares? <laughs> I mean, it's just my heritage. You know what I mean? It's not a big deal. Uh, truthfully, though, I don't know a lot about Italian culture. I'm an Italian-American. Like, I appreciate the food. I appreciate that it, it happened so I could be alive. But uh, I know only a little bit. So I wouldn't say that, um, you know, if you asked me about my life and the way I grew up compared to someone who was born in Italy, it's very different. Gonna dice up everything. Put an ingredient. All ingredients of the same type in your basket will get thrown into the machine if you click it while holding the basket. Here, I'll show you. Oh, right. Open. Open, open. Do I need one of these first? Okay, open. Did the tutorial break? One onion fell on the floor. Fuck. Where'd it go? Yo, it disappeared. Oh. I'd rather just cook in real life. Honestly. Like, at least I have hands. Like, I know how to use my hands, at least. Yeah, it's not letting me... Oh, now it is. That's very interesting. Okay. VR would probably be be good for this, but I don't think there is a VR mode. Shot in the dark is one one in the back. All the olives have um, also decided to enjoy the floor. So. There, there is a VR version for this. Okay. That might be, um... That might be good. It's not out yet. You were supposed to process that one onion earlier. Fuck! God damn it. This floor is disgusting now. You keep throwing items instead of placing them. Y yeah, it's true. I don't think that's enough olives, chat. Kind of want to make like a garden of, of them. And then we can bring our recipes and our food to um, strip malls across the United States. And then I can show the world what real Italian food tastes like with infinite breadsticks. I think the tutorial's like broken now, yeah? I can load the tutorial. Oh, 
I feel like it was like a really easy when all I had to do in life was just take the ingredients that were there and cook them. I need employees, man. Does anyone want to work with pizza? I like how my basket just flipped over. I didn't even mean to, it's just the physics of the game. Is there another white onion? The onion. Okay, so then I, I put the rest in. You can't skip a single step. Put it in the highlighted spot. Pick up a can of sweet corn. Sweet corn. Oh. Sweet corn? On pizza? Okay. Pour it directly into the Gian container. If you don't have any left, buy one. I did it. Super common in the UK, really? There's no need to cut sweet corn. We'll pour it directly into the Gian container. Do I need more corn? Didn't read. Mate! You did it wrong, so the tutorial bugged. I... <laughs> that was all of it. Magic. Magic corn. Alright. Okay, no. We have to do this in order for me to make a pizza, so... Even though I would never use corn... ...on my pizza, whatever. I respect people's choices because that's what being a professional chef is. It's the code. It's the chef's code. Alex, it's the code! Yep, tutorial's bugged. Oh! Wrong again. We are telling you. Tell me what. Put it in the highlighted spot where you put the other one. Insert the GM container with the sweet corn into the... I... What? Hover over the jar of black olives. Oh, okay, that jar is broken. So I had to put it on the shelf in order to pick it back up and put it in the spot.
when you hover over it, you can see um, methods of of stuff. Okay, good, got it. Dough mixer, cooking processor, blah blah blah. Okay. Insert. Cut into the oh. We gotta process this. A lot of olives. Yep. Done. Tutorial is good. We did it. Pick up the dough tray. Pick up the dough. The the Uno dough tray. Mm. Okay. Follow the green line. Place it down on this disgusting counter with piss stains. Nice. To finish the preparation, head back and click on the clock. W authentic Italian ingredient preparation. One pizza sold. Oh, my pizza battle pass has almost been, uh, fulfilled. Cool, you must fulfill an order next, okay. Each order is rated by your guests. You can achieve a total of five stars. What a lonely life this is. Like, I hear everyone having fun and being Italian and- Oh! Paparabutta! In the next room, can't even open the door. They welded it shut. The chef can't even interact with them. Timer starts the moment you accept the order. If you manage to complete it within 30 minutes, you earn a bronze star. Within 20, that'll net you silver. Huh. Don't worry about the time. If you go over the 30 minute mark, you can still achieve gold in other categories. Never heard someone say no to a pizza. Okay, so, uh, let's see. Serving window. Pizzeria is really busy, so don't worry about running out of orders. It has never happened. It has never happened. Are we, like, smartphone app now? Wow. We need a... Paglisi. Medium, Neapolitan dough, uh, marinara, 100 grams of mozzarella, black olives, white onion. Okay, we're doing it. We're doing our first real order. So we need medium dough. Hover over a large lump of dough. Press Q while hovering. Oh, okay. Oh, oh, you can split the dough into medium. Okay. And small. All right, so we got the dough. We're going to roll it. We got this, chat. I know how to do this part. This is all very familiar. In fact, this is in my blood. So we're going to do a little bit of marinara or marinade, as we say here in uh, New York Italian, fake Italian land. Here we go. Looks like ketchup. It looks like fucking candy, actually. 
like RTX on. I, I wish I could like, you know, make it look good, but the spoon keeps getting in the way. Looks like, yeah, looks like strawberry jelly. So we need some mozzarella. Five, that's a hundred grams. Okay. Next, black olive. What is this? Wow. That's 32 grams. We need another 32. Um... That's, uh-oh. Uh-oh. When you shove the pizza, the cheese will begin to melt. Customers expect that the whole surface of the pizza will be covered by melted cheese. Last category is the hardest one. You have to use all the ingredients that the customer asked for and spread them evenly on the pizza. Maintain a proper quantity of each ingredient. Uh-oh. Can I, like, pick off the... I think this is good, right? We, we could just roll with this. So how much? Wow. So it looks like um, the ingredients selection and the smartphone are controlled the same way. That's 16 grams. This is 32 grams. It's a little extra olive. I'd be happy with a little extra olive. Personally. This is fine. This is fine for me. I need a pizza flapjack. Here we go. It's just whoever gets that olive slice better like olives. Oh, wait a minute. Probably don't want to put the logs in after the pizza. Place the medium plate on the counter. Okay. Bake the pizza, and take it out of the oven. Okay, halfway done. It's almost in the green. We need one more log. Don't worry too much about it. Not every pizza has to be baked perfectly. Chat. You don't have to worry about me. I know, like I said, pizza's in my blood. I don't even need the tutorial. That's a fine... That's a handsome pizza. It's a little olivey. But the order's up. I know they loved it. Claim your rewards. 
Italian sausage, prosciutto cotto, young artichoke. Hmm. We'll get some uh, rosemary, Italian sausage, and mushrooms. Level up, claim your rewards. Quest re <laughs> Oh my god, this is ridiculous. Order reroll, replace an active order with a random one, up to three times per day. Quest works in a similar fashion. That's fine. And four stars. Maybe some extra olives, but... Yeah, we fucked up on one of the olives. It wasn't spread evenly. Imagine complaining about that. Excuse me, waiter. I got some bad news. You see, uh, when I made the order, you couldn't refuse. You uh, spread the olives a little unevenly. There was a little bit more on one side. So now I'm going to have to offer you protection. 20%. Just in case some unforeseen consequences were to arrive at this pizza shop. Unlocked perks can be activated by um, checking Perk Hub. It just struck me what Perk Hub might be a parody of. It's even the same color scheme. Not that I would know. It's like Grubhub. Same thing. Very similar. Okay. Take a look at the wall next to the serving window. This is the certificate proving that I've granted you the rank of a novice pizziolo. Look at the certificate. Look at it. Papa Pee Pee. What a nice um, certificate. I'll put it on my fridge. It's a shame they don't have some voiceover for this. That would make life a little easier, no? Next order. Alright, now I'm on my own. Well and truly, with no help. Uh, we got a margarita. So this is the standard. Neapolitan style dough. Is this a large pie? Medium. No, this is a medium. I need you to get out of here, pizza peel. Pizza peel. Pizza peel. Here we go. I've always wanted to be a real pizza man. This is my chance, and now I can prove it to chat without a tutorial. This is the homemade marinara sauce that we're famous for at this establishment. Including small tomatoes. Made of strawberry jelly, ketchup, and small tomato. Delicious. Sorry. Delicioso. Whoa! This is like Italian Dragon Force. Who's swimming? I feel like someone outside is assaulting me with their... La guitarra. How do I, um... Cut it with what? See any knives?
What's this? That mob boss is coming back to you to pay you back for the olive incident. Oh, fuck. Maybe the grater? Why, why would this go in a grater? No. There's basil. Oh, there's basil. Where's the ba- <laughs> Oh, this music! Um, no, seriously, what- what? It's gone. Above the pizza. Use the red food processor, not the slicer. We're losing money and fast. I love these royalty-free tunes, don't you? Wait, this has been mulched. Hmm. Enter toppings mode and look for the leaf. Ah. And that's the pizza. Someone just said, go into all range mode. Fox McCloud kind of really does sound like a little bit of a parody of Luke Skywalker. The fuck? This song? The Mother 3 song? It's the MIDI Italian version. This shit gets claimed. No, it's not the Mother 3. It's just a song that happens to be in Mother 3. It's in a lot of stuff. Yeah. In fact, this song has showed up more on Sunday stream than almost any other song. This will be my finest pizza yet. I'm gonna get very good reviews for this pizza. And we scoop. Oh my god, that looks so good. Doesn't that look good, chat? I should have, uh, got the plate a little early. This is legit making me hungry. Again, if you haven't had pizza, like a Neapolitan uh, pie, with the basil in full leaf form, and it seems we- oh. And it seems weird. I understand. It's good. It's actually really good. Okay, one pizza coming up, Margarita. Ah, oh, bellissimo, bellissimo. Bacon, buffalo mozzarella, and prosciutto. Perfect score. Oh my god. Oh my god. Ah. Uh. 
Okay. Did I level up? Oh, I got Alfredo sauce. <laughs> the pizza battle pass is leveled up. Let's go. Let's 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 do this. What's the next order? Another marinara pizza. With garlic this time. All right. Or margarita, not marinara. You know what I mean. Okay. This is the old one. This is not the way. This is the new one. All right, we get some of that sauce. This is going to have some thick crust. Okay. No cheese. What the fuck? Wait, where's the garlic? We don't have any cut garlic available. <gasps> oh no! <laughs> Sorry, uh, we didn't have garlic. We have onions. Are you okay with the substitute? Mushroom was the garlic. I, n I know there was garlic here. Should have brought the damn basket. This room is a fucking mess. It's okay, we're gonna get a bunch of garlic. One clove is not- Do you remember that time, chat, that I- I told you I cooked... ...like, some fajita dish? And I used, instead of... ...like, three cloves of garlic, I used a whole bulb. And then, like, my house smelled like garlic. My place smelled like garlic for like two weeks. Alright, it was like two days. <laughs> I like to embellish, though. At least that particular story. Why? Because I'm an idiot. It was a newbie mistake. I bet V-Dub would say that he's not a noob at cooking. But truthfully, I was. Now I'm not. Now I know the difference between bulbs and cloves. I think we have to start with the one garlic and then we can put the basket in. There's nothing in here. Where, where did it go? Vinny, you already did? Wait, what? I have no recollection of that. Did I have an aneurysm? Oh no. Someone said, oh my god, we nearly had garlic with no incident. Three, five, nine, fourteen, seventeen. A little extra garlicky, but it's good. It's good. This is the freshest garlic. This is from Tuscany. Alright, this is where the Tuscan Raiders are from. And let me tell you, they know how to make garlic. They know about our pizza. Ah, oh, it's delicious. World class. Vinny, this pizza sucks. I hate it. Truthfully, I hate it. But, this is what the customer wants, this is what the customer shall get. Nice. So yeah, it's a fresh no-cheese pie with just garlic and basil, which is a little weird, but our sauce is really good, so... You know, I get that. They want to taste the sauce. Maybe they don't like cheese, maybe they don't have the ability to eat cheese. It doesn't stay down. 
Vinny, clean, clean your counters. No. It looks like semi-burnt garlic. Again, customer's always right. Okay, we'll put this here up for order. Delicioso. Enjoy your fucking trash pie. What did I do wrong? Too much garlic. Okay, well, I'll tell you what. You're gonna have to eat my balls, okay? That's what you can have for dinner. What do we got now, huh? Let's take a look at the new order. Another marinara pie. This time we got... What the fuck is this? Still no cheese? I'm re-rolling this. Okay, now this I can do. This is a little different. We did this one already, but I like this one, so we're gonna do this one. So we do- we do the medium. Alright. We can do this- I'm gonna do this in record time, chat. Watch this. Watch how good I am now. Alright, I know exactly what I'm doing. So we're gonna put the sauce- we're gonna spread the sauce on there. Really- there we go. Decent amount of sauce. Then we get a little bit of the mozzarella. How much mozzarella we need? Another 100 gram. Do it like that. Do it like that. Do it like that. This is a speed run. Okay, and then we get the white onion. So where's the white onion? Very good. We'll get that going. We need 32 grams. That's th it's 29. You'll you'll enjoy your 29 grams. All right. Fuck you. All right. Custom is always right. Fuck you. Olives. 64. I wish I could, like, actually choose the, the, the precise amount. Oh no. Okay, now you get 84 grams of olive. Fuck you, okay? Fuck you. Huh? Okay, is this still going? No, we need a little bit more wood. I think I just, like, activated the crankshaft. That's not good. Okay. This is a good pizza. I'd eat this a pizza. Smaller circle equals smaller amount going on the pizza. Uh, nope. There's that Italian anti-gravity I was telling you about. I tried that earlier, and all it did was spread the same amount in a smaller area. And that is weird. Okay, how are we doing on the temperature? We need another log. Another log. Get that log in there. We could do one more log. I feel like where I failed as a game salesman, I'm excelling as a pizza salesman. As a pizza creator. Here we go. I saw an infographic of all the famous slices of New York City. And it's just like a drawing of each slice and what makes them different from each other. It was really cool. I'll have to show you tomorrow. Or, I'm not streaming tomorrow, actually. I guess there's an announcement. I'm taking a day. I think I streamed for like three weeks straight with no break. So tomorrow I'm taking a day. Uh-huh. But, I'll be, um, live another time. Remind me of the pizza thing. I think you'll enjoy it. And that way I can do some pizza recommendations again. You know, if... If anyone ever comes to New York City for tourism purposes again, which at the moment no one's really doing, and I can't blame you. Okay, New York style dough. There we go. Universal flour, water, salt, yeast, olive oil, sugar. Sugar. Huh. Fast feet, press space to walk faster. Plates will never break. Bottles will never break. All machines work twice as fast. I want... Feet! Um, white onion, wrong amount of ordered ingredient. Okay. Well, you know what? 
there's always the right amount of my balls, which you can have a little taste of, huh? All right, Gabagool, let's move on, huh? New pizza. Let's order next. All right. It's, uh, it's this one again. Wait, what? No, it's cheeses. Jesus Christ, what are we gonna do here? Gorgonzola. Gorgonzola? Alfredo sauce? Are you kidding me? Oh no. Oh no. No, I've had Alfredo pizza. It's fine. I just, uh, this is a lot of new stuff all at once. We got Gorgonzola? I don't think we've got Gorgonzola. Parmesan. Milk. Bacon. There, we got the Gorgonzola. Okay, so we need some cut Gorgonzola and grated Gorgonzola. Which would be the electric grater. This, this may be the final pizza of the night. This is like my final boss. Uh, in, in terms of, like, pizza. You know, this is so... This is so different than what I was doing before. I don't know if I'm gonna do well. And I have to make Alfredo sauce from scratch. Chat, can you believe it? This customer is asking for a lot. We're closing for today and won't be taking any new orders. You leveled up. Pesto. Okay. So there's the Gorgonzola. Looks like... It's weird. It's a little weird looking. Alright, that's no problem. Now how do we do cut Gorgonzola? I guess we just slice it. We gotta slice the Gorgonzola. Alright. The game agrees. Yeah, the game knows exactly what I was just thinking, which is kind of weird. How did that happen? It's like the game and I are one. It's Italian telepathy. Alright. Next, we're gonna work on the Fredo sauce. So we're gonna pin this. Alright, so there's the sliced gorgonzola. Butter. All right, we gotta get a basket. We gotta get a basket. Where is the most nearest bat? There we go. So butter. I thought that was butter. It's, it's a sponge. Okay, milk, universal flour, salt. Okay, so we're gonna get the garlic. It's a little bit of extra garlic. So we got butter in here. Butter. We only need that much. Okay, you see any milk? Chat, where's the milk? Have you seen any milk around here, chat? I see chicken breast. It's frozen! Oh, God. The wall behind you? There's the milk. Okay, universal flour. Where's the universal flour? Salt, black pepper, parmesan. So we need some of that parmesan. There we go. Whoa. Whoa. You need more garlic? Uh, maybe. That's flour, but what do we do with the flour? So we can get products universal flour. We're gonna buy some. Alright, we'll buy some of the flour. So I think we put it in the cooking processor, if I'm not mistaken. Alright, we'll start with this. Universal flour, 150 grams. Uh-oh! It's a little too much. Um, it reset. Yeah, it reset. 
That's a very small and specific amount of universal flour. No problem. Okay. So now we need salt. Ten. Oh, it's okay. It's part of the secret recipe. A little extra salt. A little extra salt is good for you. Alright. Keeps the bed bugs away. Get the black pepper. Very nice. Another ten. That's beautiful. Alright, next is the parmesan. We've got to put the whole thing in there. Just, just, <laughs> just, just put the whole thing in there. The whole thing of milk. Oh! No, that's good. Oh, I just, uh-oh. I gotta go get more milk. I thought I fucked up. You know what? No, that's fine. No, no, it's not. Ah. Uh. Well, I'm not going back down, so we're gonna go get the milk from here. And it just instantly teleports to my hands. Very convenient. Is that gonna be enough? A little more... Very good. Very good amount. Okay, garlic. Can we just put the rest of this in there? We need a little more garlic. Chat member was right. Chat member was right. Not enough milk? <laughs> no, no. No, that's enough milk. I promise you. What the fuck? Oh, the, this basket... ...is problems. This is a problem basket. Wonder if I maybe left some garlic on the floor? I forgot that I can sprint now. Okay. Okay, so we got everything we need, and then we put the canister in. I'm feeling good about this chat. The container. Five seconds. Here we go. I, I got the salt in there. I got the salt in there. And you ready? There it is. Alfredo sauce. I always wondered what that was all about. And now I know. Okay. Where's the order? I need to get to the order. Cheeses. Pin. Okay. New York style dough. Oh. Wow, for a last order, imagine this has got to be every... Like... Nightmare. If you work in the food industry, this has to be a fucking... Like, awful nightmare for you. The most difficult thing on the menu... For the very last customer. Alright, we need some music if we're going to do this. Cooking ska jazz? Universal flower. It's going to put a bunch of that in there. Good. Good enough. Very done. Very good. All right, some water. Hmm. How do we get water without breaking the jug, I wonder? Here's how. Water and water, water, water. Uh-oh, that's not enough water. It's cheap enough. It's 
cheap enough. It's cheap enough. Should have got that perk where the bottles don't break. I wonder if, like, the game is gonna lag even further if I just keep, like, breaking shit. God, you gotta be kidding me! There we go! Just enough, not too much! Not too much, uh, fuck. Fuck. I wish I knew more Italian than just, like, two words. That way I can... I can pretend. a little extra salt. Again, it doesn't really matter. A little extra salt is good. I'm telling you, with a little extra salt, it gives it a little more flavor. Vinny, there's glass in there? No. Alright, a little bit. Alright, there's a little glass in there. Get the yeast in. A little olive oil. Where did I put the olive oil? See, this is why you gotta keep a clean kitchen. Take it from me, Master Chef. And a little sugar. This is fine. I wonder... If it's too olive oily, is the dough consistency gonna be, like, poop? Homemade pizza dough. This is not counting as New York dough. You didn't add enough flour? This song perfectly encapsulates my rage. We're going again. Fuck it, we'll go again. Here we go. 3.5 kg. Come on. Exactly 3.5. Brilliant. Not that I even needed to order that much, but uh, okay, I'm gonna- I'm just gonna order a jug, and I'm gonna be real careful with it. Two point three. One full jug worth. There it is. Perfect amount of water in record time. Good frame rates. All right. We need. Uh, let's let's do. Where's the salt? Did I throw it? Yeah, I threw it. I, oh, it's like you got to keep a clean kitchen. Clean kitchen. That's sugar. Oh, is that too much? Is that gonna- is it gonna ruin the dough? Oh no! Oh no! The salt was in the sink. It should be okay. As long as I don't, like, go too much over with anything else, it should be okay. 
This is still sugar. Oh my god. Okay, here it is. We gotta see, chat. This- this might be it. This is the final moment. I need to deliver the proper amount of olive oil. I have to be very careful here. Ninety milliliters. Perfect amount of olive oil. Perfect. And one yeast. We're gonna make the best goddamn New York style pizza. Close. Go. Come on. Come on, New York style pizza dough. Yes! It counts! Okay. Large. So we need a large. This is gonna be, again, this is the final boss. It really is. Mental. Okay, so then, uh, it's full- it's Alfredo. All Alfredo. I can't really tell. I like how the A and D buttons, it says move camera left or right. So that was a lie. Should be enough Alfredo. We need cut Gorgonzola. So this is cut gorgonzola. We need, um, 140 grams. I mean, I mean, really? Is this- this is really what you want? I need grated mozzarella now. I don't want to hear that. Okay, um, I- I- we're not done yet. I gotta grate some mozzarella. This is taking too long. We're gonna lose money because of this one pizza. This one order. Gonna be homeless again. Come on, where's the good mozzarella? There it is, mozzarella. There we go. Grated mozzarella. Wait, do I have that already? Too late. We're making more. Doesn't matter, we got more for tomorrow. It'll, it'll stay fresh. Let's see, where was the grated... Uh, gorgonzola... Uh, mozzarella grated. 64 grams. Perfect. And yes, we already had it. Where's the gorgonzola grated? There it is. Grated... Grated Zola. Here it is. Okay, 128. I am officially out of grated gorgonzola. Huh. Then he know you're not. It's full there. Why wouldn't it let me put the, the Zol? That's weird. Now it's okay. It just wouldn't let me press the button. Vinny, that's Mott's. I know it. They want two grated mozzarellas. Look at the ingredients! But 
it won't let me... 64 and 64. That's good. No, maybe a little more. Something is glitched where I can't press the button. I, I already went way too over. Good, good. Well, okay. Well, whatever. This is not my fault anymore, and I don't feel bad because the game wouldn't let me put the mozzarella on. So 36 and 36, we need 72. This doesn't make any sense. Why would it be divided up like that? Maybe it's a half and half pizza? Like half is cut and half is grated gorgonzola? I don't know. Yeah, I won't rotate the fucking leaves. This... I'm... Listen. I was done with my shift 15 minutes ago. And then this clown came in with a fucking custom pizza order. You think I'm gonna give this, um... customer the satisfaction of rotated basil leaves? No. No, we don't do that here at, at uh, Vincenzo's. Many dicks will be eaten before I do that. Here we go. Here we go. Will this be a, a winner of a pizza? It's bumpy. It doesn't make any sense. It's got mountains. Here you go. Enjoy your fucking pizza. Uh, I- the time was the worst part. Everything else? Magnif- Uh, how do you say magnificent in Italian? Magnifico! How do I go home? I'm done. Day's over. Do we never go home? Finish the day early? Mate. Well, we earned a little bit of money. I mean... Even, you know, got a couple perfect pizzas. One perfect pizza. Just one. That last pizza earned us a lot of money. But was like a nightmare to create. I guess this is day two. Um. I like how no one bothered to clean this place up. Pizza dick and pizza da! All right, we're good. Well, I made a pizza for you. I want to know what the chaos tool is all about. But if I ever play this again, then maybe I'll do that. But for now, we did it. We defeated the final boss of pizza, which was homemade dough, homemade Alfredo, and lots of gorgonzola. Not bad. And that's how you do it at Vincenzo's Pizza Shop.